Okay, what I'd like to show you is the Spur Gears Calculator, which is in the Web Machinist program for Windows computers. Um, the current version of Web Machinist that I'm using here is 13.0, and as of this date, uh, April of 2019, that is the latest version. Well, anyway, to uh, calculate Spur Gears, just come down here on the main menu uh, to where it says Spur Gears. And just click on the spur gears button and you can go to the spur gears main menu menu and from there you're given a choice of either to do calculations for imperial spur gears or for module metric spur gears uh, spur gears let's go ahead and do an imperial uh, calculation so you can see how this works um, very very simple program uh, but very powerful as far as calculating the dimensions of spur gears. All you have to do is click the calculate button and it's going to ask you a few uh, little things here. First of all, the number of teeth. Let's just put in 24 teeth. And then the diametral uh, pitch diameter. Let's just make something up, put something in there. Let's say it's a 6.788 diameter. And then you choose your pressure angle. Uh, let's just go ahead and leave it at 14 and a half degrees. Click OK. And you can see now that uh, the spur gear calculator within the Web Machinist program has calculated uh, all of your needed dimensions for your spur gear, including the outside diameter, the pitch diameter, hole depth, root diameter, addendum, dedendum, clearance, circular, circular tooth thickness, circular pitch, and your base circle. So this is all really, really helpful. You don't have to get out the old calculator and calculate all this yourself. Um, there's also a mod module metric calculator for spur gears. Just click this button down here. And it takes you into the module metric spur gear calculator. Once again, all you have to do is hit calculate. And it's going to ask you the module, module number. Let's just say 20. And I say the number of teeth is 28. Click OK. And the spur gear calculator is now going to give you all the same type of dimensions that you did on the Imperial, um, except for the metric version, of course, in the module. Well, that's it. That's all there is to it. It's a really powerful part of the Web Machinist software program. Save you a lot of time. And uh, if you'd like to check check it out and how you can obtain a copy, just go to webmachinist.net. Thanks for watching this video.